Ladies and gentlemen, dear colleagues, my name is Yakovleva Alena Vcheslavovna. I am from Tver State Medical University, Faculty of Pharmacy. And the topic of my talk today will be innovative drug delivery systems, drug loaded implants. I'd like to start with this definition, advantages and disadvantages, then go to the classification, and finally concentrate on the application. The oral route is a popular and convenient means of drug delivery. However, despite its advantages, it also has challenges. Many drugs are not suitable for oral delivery due to first pass metabolism, less than ideal properties and side effects of treatment. Additionally, oral delivery relies heavily on patient compliance. Drug-loaded implants are a relatively new and innovative type of pharmaceutical product that offers a number of advantages over traditional drug administration methods. Implantable drug delivery systems are small, biocompatible devices that are surgically implanted into the body, allowing for the slow and long-term release of drugs into the system. Let's look at the advantages of drug-loaded implants. These systems allow targeted and localized drug delivery and may achieve a therapeutic effect with lower concentrations of drug. As a result, they may minimize potential side effects of therapy while offering the opportunity for increased patient compliance. This type of system also has the potential to deliver drugs which would normally be unsuitable orally because it avoids first pass metabolism and chemical degradation in the stomach and intestine, thus increasing bioavailability. Another benefit of implantable drug delivery systems is that they are less invasive than other methods of drug administration. By being implanted directly into the body, there is no need for needles and other forms of drug delivery, reducing the risk of discomfort and infection. Additionally, implants can be designed to release drugs at specific intervals, allowing for greater control of drugs level in the body. Furthermore, drug-loaded implants are also beneficial for patient compliance. By having the drug released over a long period of time, Patients are not required to take multiple doses each day, thereby reducing the risk of forgetting to take the medication. This, in turn, increases the likelihood that the patient will take the drug as prescribed and receive the full benefit of the medication. Nevertheless, implantable drug delivery devices are bulky, especially when compared to nanoparticles, battery-powered, which limits their implantation depth. One of the main drawbacks of implants, along with host immune rejection, is the surgical procedures. Once an implant has been placed in the body, the defense systems recognize it as a foreign body, and this results in the initiation of immune reactions, such as inflammation, hypersensitivity reactions, and rejection of implants. Generally, drug-loaded implants are expensive, so not everyone can afford them. Moreover, they may not be able to be used in certain populations, such as children or elderly patients. Furthermore, drug-loaded implants can cause serious side effects if the drug is released too quickly or too slowly. Depending on the used polymers, we can classify drug-loaded implants as biodegradable and non-biodegradable. Biodegradable implants offer the most convenient option for drug delivery, as the implant needs to be placed in the body only once, and it does not need to be removed. The degradation products of the biodegradable implants are assumed to be traces of carbon dioxide, water, and mineral elements. In contrast, non-biodegradable implants require surgical procedure twice, as they need to be inserted and removed once drug delivery is achieved. Examples of such implants include drug eluting stents, scaffolds for tissue engineering, heart valves, pacemakers, and ocular inserts. As for application, drug loaded implants are used to treat a variety of chronic diseases, including cancer, arthritis, diabetes, and cardiovascular diseases. They can also be used to deliver antibiotics and hormones for long-term treatment. In conclusion, drug-loaded implants offer a number of advantages over traditional methods of drug administration. By allowing for the slow and long-term delivery of drugs, these implants can improve safety, efficacy, and patient compliance. As such, they are becoming increasingly popular in the field of pharmacy and are likely to continue to gain in popularity in the years to come. Thank you for your attention.